So all right, so the next topic that we're going to be talking about here is the filter search area here. And if you are brand new and you have not tagged anything yet, the, the tags feature will not work because you haven't added any tags. And we're going to get that get to that section in this uh, series, okay? Or you can go ahead and jump to the tagging section uh, if you're looking at this through the help documents, okay? So basically, it is going to search through the database and it's going to look for the keyword, keyword that you type. Now, for example, I have already pre tagged uh, these two files here with Penny Duncan Creation, okay? Because that is the creator. A lot of times people will tag things with who created them, okay? So, for example, if I type in Penny, I don't even have to type in the full word and I go ahead and hit search, it will filter that for me. And those are the two files that I have tagged with Penny Duncan Creations, okay? Now you can go back to name, and we have a lot of Mojo Mondays. So if I type in Mojo and I hit search, it will pull up all the Mojo Mondays that appear in your library. Okay, so that is the, the search feature. And if you need to reset, you can always click this button right here and that will bring your entire library back up okay so that will do it for the search feature it's a quick little search feature remember I said search by word uh, you cannot search multiple words um, it will only do a single word search okay so keep on watching keep on going to the next tutorial and we'll see you on the next one okay